Hey guys, welcome back. I want to show you a little custom PC we're working on here just to show you pretty much all the stuff we work on and some of the things we run into. This is a, a custom desktop. Doesn't look like a Mac, right? Uh, the gentleman does photography, so he's got a lot of storage. He's got about eight hard drives there. And it's a pretty nice rig. And uh, it's running Mac OS. Let me show you that. This is a screen right here. Um, and basically what we're doing is we're running some tests on the temperature. What was going on with this unit was, uh, actually let me show you the OS here. And that's what it's running. A little bit old, old, old uh, OS. 24 gigs. So it's a nice little rig. Uh, gentleman's into photography and stuff like that. So he needed something with some uh, nice power. Didn't want to spend it on a full Mac. So he put this thing together. Or he had somebody put it together. Basically what happened was he had taken it to a couple places. The unit was turning on and turning off. And uh, took it to a couple places. They wind up uh, initially telling them it was the power supply that was failing. Then they went into uh, the motherboard was failing. So we spent some time on it here. It didn't take a whole lot of time for us to figure out that the, uh, the water cooler that it had was the one that was failing. This little guy here. Kind of an off-brand uh, cooler here. And uh, the interesting part is that it wasn't 100% failing. It, it, it worked for a little bit and cut off. So those intermediate, intermediate, uh, intermittent problems are the ones that sometimes are just very difficult. You can't pinpoint them. Uh, some of the symptoms were of that of a, of a motherboard or a RAM or a power supply. It could have been any of those, but... Uh, we nailed it down to uh, to that, and basically we have it just here running, cranking it. We'll you know run it for you know 24 hours, but I mean it's good to go. It's already run for about two hours straight, and temperature's good. Whereas before it was you know climbing up pretty quick. So uh, pretty much we work on anything, even these crazy uh, rigs that they got going on. And here we got a couple other. Here's another custom PC. Gentleman uh, purchased it, put it together, and couldn't get it to run so there were some cables out of place there was a ram uh, that was not seated properly simple things but just things that you know if you don't do this every day it would just like slip through the cracks and the more frustrated you get you just can't find the problem sometimes you have it right in front of you and uh, this one here has been for about a week this is a serious intermittent problem computer works for about 24 hours 30 hours and then it reboots uh, so basically whenever you change something or we change a RAM or uh, pretty much the, the diagnosis is make your adjustments and then wait, you know, two days. So it's been here for a while. I mean, it's not a lot of, it's not a lot of hands on time, uh, but it's something that's just going to be here for a while. And I think we got it down pat. In the end, it looks like it was just a bad seated RAM, which is kind of crazy that we spent all this time on that. Um, but sometimes that's the way it goes. So that's what we're doing over here at PC911. You got any problems? Bring it. We'll take care of it for you.